The Haunting of St. Agnes, a documentary of terror, in the quiet town of Ravenswood, nestled amidst the fog-shrouded hills, stood the ancient St. Agnes Abbey, a relic of bygone centuries. Once a beacon of divine sanctity, it now bore the heavy burden of a sinister past, its walls echoing with the whispers of forgotten sins. This is the story of the chilling events that unfolded within its hallowed halls. The Abbey's dark history began centuries ago, when a malevolent force was said to have taken root within its sacred confines. Tales of inexplicable occurrences and unexplained phenomena became the fabric of local legend, from eerie apparitions wandering the corridors to unearthly wails echoing through the night, the specter of evil hung heavy over St. Agnes. In the fall of 2023, a team of documentary filmmakers embarked on a quest to uncover the truth behind the Abbey's haunted reputation. Armed with cameras and curiosity, they ventured into the heart of darkness, unaware of the horrors that awaited them. The Abbey's caretaker, an aging man with haunted eyes, welcomed the filmmakers with a weary smile, warning them of the malevolent presence that lurked within. Undeterred by his ominous words, the crew pressed on, eager to capture the essence of fear on film. As night fell and shadows lengthened, the Abbey transformed into a realm of nightmares. Strange noises echoed through the empty corridors, and cold drafts chilled the air. The filmmakers pressed record, their hearts pounding with anticipation. Their first encounter with the supernatural came in the form of a chilling EVP session in the Abbey's chapel. As they called out to the spirits that dwelled within, a voice whispered through the static, speaking words of ancient malice. Goosebumps prickled their skin as they realized they were not alone. The following night brought even greater horrors, as one of the crew members, a skeptic who scoffed at the notion of ghosts, became possessed by an unseen entity. His eyes turned black as coal, and his voice took on a guttural tone as he spoke in tongues unknown to man. Frantic, the remaining filmmakers sought the help of a local priest, hoping that divine intervention could save their friend from the clutches of evil. But as the exorcism began, the entity within the possessed man fought back with furious intensity, unleashing a torrent of violence that shook the abbey to its core. The walls seemed to groan with agony as the battle between good and evil raged on, each passing moment threatening to tip the scales in favor of darkness. The possessed man contorted in agony, his screams echoing through the night, while the priest struggled to maintain his faith in the face of overwhelming darkness. Just when all hope seemed lost, a glimmer of light pierced the darkness, as the entity was finally expelled from the man's body, vanquished by the power of faith and determination. But the victory was short-lived, for as the filmmakers emerged from the abbey, they realized that they had unwittingly unleashed a force far more sinister than they could have imagined. In the weeks that followed, the town of Ravenswood descended into chaos as the malevolent entity that had once dwelled within St. Agnes Abbey spread its influence, leaving a trail of death and destruction in its wake. The Abbey itself became a cursed relic, shunned by all who dared to tread its cursed halls. And so, the tale of St. Agnes Abbey stands as a grim reminder of the dangers that lurk in the shadows, waiting to consume the souls of the unwary. For in the darkness, evil lies in wait, ready to pounce on those who dare to disturb its slumber. And once unleashed, it can never be contained again. And so, the tale of St. Agnes Abbey stands as a grim reminder of the dangers that lurk in the shadows, waiting to consume the souls of the unwary. For in the darkness, evil lies in wait, ready to pounce on those who dare to disturb its slumber. And once unleashed, it can never be contained again. Tell IGN what nightmarish story you would like to hear next.